Hi and welcome to Sterling Report. The Detroit Tigers recently did a 30-stop tour throughout Metro Detroit, and one of their stops was right here in Sterling Heights as the team visited Sterling Heights High School. Ten Tigers showed up to a crowded house at the Sterling Heights High School Performing Arts Center. Some of the key Tigers included Justin Verlander, Ian Kroll, and Buck Farmer. The players joined in games with many of the young fans in attendance. Student reporters from Warren Consolidated Schools were allowed to ask questions of the hometown team. The 2015 Winter Caravan gives the Tigers an opportunity to interact with the community prior to the upcoming baseball season. It is our annual opportunity every year to go out and connect with the community because many of our players don't live in this market and when they are here during the season, they're so busy. They don't get a chance to shake hands and get to know the community. So this is our marquee event where they go and they visit schools like being here at Sterling Heights High School. They do a lot of other community events. The team will visit 30 locations in two days, culminating in a visit to the North American International Auto Show at Cobo Hall. It's been good. This is uh, our third stop today. We went to uh, Federal Bank, which we got to see about $7 billion in cash and coins, so that's definitely the most amount of money anybody has seen. And that was pretty exciting. And then they told us that they, I guess they rip up and shred about 4 to $6 million a day, so that kind of made everybody a little angry. But uh, it was good. Then we went to Lapari, the food, and had a little competition. And, um, and now we're here at the at the school with the kids where we have the most fun, so it's good. What is it like seeing all these kids' faces light up with joy? Uh, that's, it's a, that's a very special feeling. You know, that's, you know, as a kid, you know, you remember being in their position and, and somebody of our stature comes around, you know, you, you remember that feeling that you had and just to see it on their faces, it, uh, it makes you feel good. A few lucky members of the Detroit Tigers Kids Club were given a chance to attend a special meet and greet with their baseball heroes. Several prizes were also given out to the fans, mainly consisting of autograph balls and tickets to selected events in the Metro Detroit area. The school was honored with a special number 25 jersey to commemorate the 25th anniversary of Warren Kahn's School of Performing Arts. That's going to wrap up this edition of Sterling Report. Till next time, take care.